Welcome to ETV Bharat. This is News Time. The center on Thursday told the Supreme Court that a decision has been taken to cancel the grace marks awarded to 1,563 NEET UG 2024 candidates, and these students will be given an option to take a re-examination, and results will be announced before the counselling. At least 14 Keralites have been identified among those killed in the deadly fire at the labour camp in Kuwait on Wednesday. India's mission in Kuwait is ascertaining full details from the concerned Kuwaiti authorities on the tragic fire incident in a building in Kuwait which killed 49 foreign workers including 40 Indians and injured 50 others. Thursday marked a special day for devotees of Lord Jagannath as the four gates of the 12th century Jagannath temple a prominent among char dhams were reopened after 4 years. The Jammu and Kashmir Police released sketches of four terrorists involved in two attacks in Doda district and announced a reward of rupees 20 lakh for information leading to their arrest. A 60-year-old farmer died by suicide due to harassment by a money lender to repay the loan in Mahasmud district of Chhattisgarh on Wednesday. A group of seven summit is opening on Thursday with agreement on a US proposal to back a 50 billion dollar loan to the Ukraine using frozen Russian assets as collateral. PM Modi's visit to Italy marks his first international trip since assuming office for the third term. Houthi rebels in Yemen launched a boat-borne bomb attack on a commercial ship in the Red Sea resembling the 2000 USS Kohl attack despite efforts to secure the waterway. India made it to the Super 8s of the T20 World Cup 2024 with a 7 wicket win over the USA on Thursday at the Nassau County Cricket Stadium. Actors Sonakshi Sinha and Zaheer Iqbal's wedding invitation has been leaked where the couple reveals their plans to marry on June 23rd in Mumbai. Log on to etvbharat.com for latest news.